she said. I'm in Serbia. Look around you. What you see are ghosts. Intoxicated ghosts. Touch them. Touch the ghosts. Each character in this room has been chosen deliberately. Amassed amongst us are some of the largest personalities of the day. Artists, revolutionaries, politicians, dead royals! And sadly, assassins. Simple. <laughs> and we will require your full participation to ensure the success of our event. Rule number one. The first time you hear your character's name read, please enunciate your text as given on the bottom of your character biography forcefully and without hesitation. This means you must pay attention. <laughs> also, keep in mind that your text may occur simultaneously with other events. This is capitalist propaganda! <laughs> Order reigns in Berlin. Revolution! Silence, all of you! <laughs> Rule number two! When this happens, Whisper, warn the Duke! about you. I have no idea why, but I'm deeply worried about you. You have no idea how nervous I am. My friend! My Irish. I have thought long and hard about the simplest way to introduce to you why we are gathered here tonight. To there is There is symmetry and wholeness in big round numbers with zeros. <laughs> we are all old enough to feel the passage of a decade. But what of a century? Cover yourself, do you? The passage of a century is sufficient time to clear the decks completely. Every human being who might have remembered significant, significant events taking place in 1914 has passed on. Let us be free. Consider that in 1914, the year 2014 shimmered as impossibly on the horizon as does 2114 to us today. We could take an educated guess about what the 2020s and even the 2030s promise. Cat videos! Terminators! <laughs> Terminator cat videos! That's the future. Anyone who saw the film Her remember that the seamless integration of technology into our lives is a recurring obsession of modernity. Yet, given the present rate of technological escalation, anything beyond, say, 25 years from now, never mind 100, is beyond our grasp. The ghosts present in this room could hardly have imagined routine intercontinental flight. 
nor the compact disc, nor the internet. For the third Star Wars prequel. <laughs> and yet, 100 years from now, Washingtonians will gather in spaces much like this one, perhaps reminiscing about the distant, unknowable days of 2014. Our fashion, music, and concerns, quaint and haphazardly understood, regardless of how vainly we imagine the permanent cataloging of our incessant social media chatter, will attain for our lives a preservation unavailable to prior generations. I just put that on Instagram, that whole speech. Isn't the desire for immortality a basic tenet of human beings? Yet, the more likely truth is, when we are dead and gone, the mundane tribulations of our lives will be as unknowable and perhaps as uninteresting to the living as theirs appear to us now. But not tonight! Tonight is a night to return to 1914, to welcome these ghosts from the past to guide us, to teach us. For this night, many of you has a new identity. And like good actors, please use your imaginations to conjure alternate personas. Surprise yourself. If you are asked a question about your character and do not know the answer, make one up. <laughs> History, as Napoleon once said, is a lie agreed to. Let us, for the first time, begin to materialize a few of these ghosts. 